weeks after the Hoboken City Council adopted a controversial 10-year extension to the Church Towers Payment in Lieu of Taxes program. Fourth Ward Councilwoman and mayoral candidate Dawn Zimmer has released a proposed resolution to revamp the pilot application process. Church Towers is a middle-income affordable housing complex. Zimmer's proposal, which she hopes will be adopted by the council at Wednesday's meeting, would require that applications for pilot tax abatements contain an analysis of the projected costs to the taxpayers. This resolution is, is about transparency. It's about helping the city council and the public to understand what's the impact. If we look at when we do the pilot agreement versus if we don't do the pilot agreement, what's the impact on the municipal taxes and, and doing calculations for the county and for the school board taxes. So that's really what it's, what it's all about. And if, so it's basically calling for a 30-day period where we get that analysis. The city council has the analysis. The public has the analysis. And then before any resolution comes before the city council, we have those numbers and then as, as when it's approved, we have those numbers. And if it doesn't work out where it's, you know, really helping the taxpayer, then we need to know what is the give back? What are we getting in exchange for the taxpayer, you know, basically paying more for this pilot agreement? What's the give back? We, we need to make sure that we're getting a strong give back. When the council voted to adopt the Church Towers pilot extension, Zimmer and Fifth Ward Councilman Peter Cunningham voted against the measure, saying they needed more time to review and discuss it. An amendment added to the extension gives the city the authority to prevent church towers from converting to condominiums or going market rate within the next decade.